sixth grade, module six, lesson 15, problem set. Number one, the box below summarizes the maximum speeds of certain kinds of fish. A, estimate the values of the five number summary from the box plot. So the five number summary includes the minimum and the maximum. I always think of those two first, and then I think, so we're looking for the minimum and the maximum, we're looking for what's in the middle or the median, and then um, in between each of those we have quartile one and quartile three. So that's the order that I think of the five number summary in. Um, you can think of it a different way, but that's just what makes me remember the order. Okay, so let's start with the min and the max. So the minimum is right there, it looks like it's 35, and the maximum is right there, so maybe like 67 or 68. So let's go 35 miles per hour for minimum, and let's say 68 miles per hour for the maximum. Now let's look at the median. The median's this middle number right here. 42 miles per hour. Quarter one, quartile one is right here. We have 39 miles per hour. And quartile three right here would be like 48. So we had 39 and 48. Now, if you see it and you're off like one or two, we're just estimating there because it doesn't give us exact. So, okay, so those are, that is your five number summary. B, the fastest fish is the sailfish at 68 miles per hour. So there's one fish right here that is 68 miles per hour. That's the sailfish, followed by the marlin at 50 miles per hour. So the next fastest is a marlin all the way down here. So there's a pretty big difference between the fastest and then the next one. What does this tell you about the spread of the fish speeds in the top quarter of the box plot? So what's it tell us? I would say it tells us that they're, it's a pretty large spread considering the whole thing is only, the whole width is only about that long and this fourth quarter takes up a very, um, large amount of the data. So I would say that quartile three is about 48. So all but two of the fish in the top quarter are between 48 and 50. Or all of all but this one are between 48 and 50. So that's what we know about that. So let's say um, quartile three is 48 miles per hour. So all but one fish, the sailfish, are between 48 miles per hour and 50 miles per hour. So everyone else lies right in between there in quartile three or quartile four. C. Use the five number summary and the IQR to describe the speeds of the fish. So the IQR, we need to fi figure that out. The IQR is the difference or the distance from quartile one to quartile three. So since quartile one is here at 38, or was it 39? 39. Sorry. 39. Quartile 3 was over here at 48, was it? So the difference, the distance there is 9 miles per hour. So what we could say is that um, the IQR is 9 per, per, miles per hour, so the middle half of the speeds are between 39 and 48 miles per hour. Okay, so let's say, we're, if we're just examining the data, you use to start with, say, the minimum is 35. They range from 35 to um, 68 miles per hour. Let's say the speeds range from 
35 to 68 miles per hour. The IQR was 9. Uh, we could say in the middle half of the speeds here, meaning are between 39 miles per hour and 48 miles per hour. We could say that half of the speeds, so right here is the median at 42, half of the speeds are less than 42 miles per hour. Number two, suppose the interquartile range for the number of hours students spent playing video games during the school week was 10. What do you think about each of the following statements? Explain your reasoning. So the IQR is 10, or the distance here, this purple distance. I know this is a different problem, but just to get it in your mind, the distance from quartile 1 to quartile 3, the middle range here, is 10 for this problem. So about half of a about half of the students played video go games for 10 hours during the week what do we think about that um what do we think about the following statements i mean that could be true we don't know the range of intervals uh or the width of the interval so it could be could be true could not be true um let's just say a let's say that could be correct We know we know the width of the interval is 10. So we know the width of the interval contains the middle half. of times was 10, but what we don't know where it starts or stops. So um, we're saying that they played for 10 hours during the school week. It could be true, it could not be true, as long as it falls um, within um, where the IQR is 10, it could be true. B, all of the students played at least 10 hours of video games during the school week. So, I mean, kind of the same thing. We, it could be true. I mean, it's kind of the same answer as the last question. So I'm just going to say, could be true. We'll just say C, A. C, answer to A. It's the same explanation. Okay, C, about half of the class could have played video games from 10 to 20 hours a week or from 15 to 20 hours a week. So again, could be true, as long as we're talking about half of the class, so it's good. So this is 10 to 20 hours, so that is an IQR of 10, and here 15 to 20, not 5 hours, so that's an interval of 10. So as long as you're picking one, yes, could be true. but also could not be true because we don't have all the data so <laughs> um, just say either could be correct because IQR is 10 
Number three, suppose you know the following for a data set. The minimum value is 130, the lower quartile is 142, the IQR is 30, half of the data are less than 168, and the maximum value is 195. Think of a context for which these numbers might make sense. Sketch a box plot. So just think, we're just thinking of a scenario where this could be true. Um, think about like 130 different numbers. Um, the answer keys example is like the possibility for the number of calories in a serving of fruit, or you could say like the number of calories in a serving of like some snack, a snack like potato chips. Um, you could think about something sports, like the number of yards a certain player ran in a game, in a football game, or something like that. Um, so just think of any context for which these numbers might make sense. I'm going to go with calories and a serving of fruit. B. Sketch a box plot. All right. So I'm going to start. Do we know the minimum is 130, maximum 195? So I'm going to start with that. Our minimum is 130. I'm going to go 130 to 195. Let's count by tens. Or, sorry, fives. Let's see. I'm going to have to extend it. That's okay. 180, 185. So it'll be 190, 195. Okay, so we know our maximums here, minimums here. Um, do we know the median? We know the lower quartile is 142, so I'll just do the lower quartile there, and we can connect that. So I'll connect the minimum to the lower quartile. IQR is 30, so I know that the, if I count up, I know the width is 130, so one, I'm just going to add 30 to the lower quartile, and I'll get 172, so that means the upper quartile is 172, right here, so I can make my box. And then I'll connect to the med the maximum here, and then Let's see, half of the data are less than 168. So that means that the median is 168 if half of it is less than that. So my median is right there. So that's our box plot. C, are there more data values above or below the median? Explain your reasoning. Well, the median is the middle number. So there shouldn't be any data. It should be the middle. It shouldn't be, there shouldn't be more above or below, that should be the exact middle number. So neither is the answer. Let's say should be about the same. Half of all the data is the median. Number four, the speeds for the fastest dogs are given in the table below. A, find the five number salary summary for this data set. Use it to create a box plot. So we're, let's do the five number summary. First, what we need to do is put them in order from least to greatest. So I'm gonna do that and come back. All right, I've listed them out. So let's find the min, maximum, median, Quartile one and quartile three. Uh, let's see, I'll cross out three. So I'm finding the median first, which is 30. I can also find the minimum, it was 20. The maximum was 45. So let's find quartile three and one. 
So I'll start with quartile one. So we're gonna find the middle of this bottom set of numbers is 28. And now let's find the middle of the upper quartile is 36. So there's our five number summary. It's all in miles per hour, so you can add the label. And then we need to make a box plot. So we go range from 20 to 45 miles per hour. So I'll go 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. So this is in miles per hour. Call it speed in miles per hour. And we'll title it uh, fastest stops. Or you could say dog speeds. I mean, it doesn't matter. Okay. So our minimum, or let's start with the median, was 30. The maximum, actually let's do quartile 1 is 28, so about right there. Quartile 3 is 36, so over here. Let's draw the box. And we just need to connect the minimums and the maximums, so here we took 20, and then up to 45. There's our box plot. B, why is the median not in the center of the box? So it's saying, why is the median right here? That's it's not the middle of that box. Um, well, the median's not in the middle of the box because it's showing that about a fourth of the speeds are between 30 and 36. Here. So there's a fourth of the speeds here between 30 and 36, and a fourth of the speeds here between 28 and 30. So it's not necessarily where you just plop the median in the middle of the box. It's about the data points and how many lie in that range. So let's say B, median is not in the center. because about one-fourth of the speeds are between 30 and 36. And another fourth are closer together. Between 28 and 30. And see, write a few sentences telling your friend about the speeds of the fastest stop. So just summarize the data. We could say the minimum for the speeds range from 20 miles per hour up to 45 miles per hour. Um, you can say that the middle 50% of the speeds are between 28 and 36 miles per hour, or that's the IQR. Um, the slowest dog you could get into, say like the slowest dog is the American cattle dog. And the fastest is the greyhound at 45 miles per hour. So just explain the data and write a few sentences about everything we've talked about.